guys good morning i miss you guys so much okay i haven't been on a vlog in a long time that is like i actually haven't been on youtube in a while now that i think about it i actually haven't been on this space in a while so i'm excited to come back oh. the thing is i started this vlog yesterday and I'm like, if I don't do an intro for this vlog, I'm never gonna do an intro for the vlog because I keep going. Like, I see that I have stuff that I just wanna show you guys and I'm not talking. So, yeah, but I just wanted to say hi, good morning, you're welcome. Um, my name's Akusia, Akusia Behini, okay? I'm into beauty, lifestyle content. Majority of my content is really beauty, but also life is lifing right now and then i'm like i might as well bring you guys along because i am so freaking busy <laughs> with like working and you know just finding work life balance is um what is killing me right now so i'm like i might as well bring you guys along so if you haven't seen me in a while hi <laughs> hey boo what do you do okay of course i still remember the intro Duh. <laughs> but um, if you're new you're welcome I hope you like my content it's gonna be all over the place for a while but trust and believe that the girl is gonna come back okay um, but yeah I just wanted to do an intro and then get on with the day I have quite a lot of content to create today's Monday I think it's September 25th or 26th I think I'm not going to work today so I'm not gonna keep the date in mind <laughs> the only days I care about is like the days that i go to work <laughs> but also you guys will see like my work life and everything um along over the course of the vlog um i'm hoping to vlog weekly weekly <laughs> i'm hoping to make this like a weekly vlog so hopefully i'm able to do it um but it feels normal like it feels natural to pick up the camera again um I feel for it you know like I'm in the space where I feel like I feel for it so yeah but you guys are welcome um, let's do the day together it's Monday um, I have content to create I'm off work on Monday so I usually create some content on Monday try to like batch create create content for some of the brands that I work with and um, yeah so we'll do that today and also just basically do the day do the week you know I haven't been here for a while so scrap the fact that the intro is long but i hope you enjoy and let's do the day all right i'm making breakfast um i'm making myself some really quick breakfast let me put you guys here but also there's so much that we have to talk about because i haven't been here in a while i just toasted my bread it's so hard but it's peasant bread i love peasant bread this stuff is so good especially for like breakfast sandwiches and it's so good it's so good it's crunchy on the outside but so nice and soft on the inside so i like it i made some this is like some sardine mix i know it doesn't look cute but it tastes really good it's a mixture of sardine and baked beans um a mixture of sardine and baked beans so i just put that on my bread let me put you guys here i think that works so i'm just gonna put that on my bread I think I gave way too much to my husband <laughs> and then now I don't have enough huh. but yeah this is gonna do for now and I'm gonna put some mayo no this is actually salad cream this is Ghana salad cream this stuff is like this is original salad cream okay <laughs> all the other stuff they sell here crap this good this stuff tastes really good my eggs which have very sadly dried out look at that <laughs> that is so sad but it should work perfectly fine I'm just gonna rest oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I had a little like egg spill which I really like that's how I like my like breakfast egg you know situation because I like it to be nice and soft get some knife And then I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this up. Oh, oh, the egg, the egg. 
so this is kind of what it looks like on the inside which is like you know good stuff <laughs> so i'm just gonna have this for breakfast Hey guys, let me show you guys the dress that I have on. Do you guys see what the back looks like? I mean, my mirror is not the best, but you see the dress that I have on. It's really cute. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys because I have my lights on. I just finished filming. Um, I filmed a makeup look and then I also filmed sort of like a get ready with me outfit because i had this like fall outfits that i really wanted to film um and it's also from amazon vine so i figured let me create content out of this that way i'm able to like you know proper review this let me set you guys up here and show you what it looks like so this is the dress what it looks like this is what the back looks like it has a whole cutout situation which is really really cute but it's also very short <laughs> it's very short but that's what it looks like okay nice cutie <laughs> these shoes oh sorry <laughs> this is what they look like these shoes are entirely too pretty do you guys see this is what they look like with the whole little butterfly on top. It's really cute. I love it. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Okay. <laughs> See? <laughs> yeah, I love it. So, um, that was the inspo and the bag that I had on was an outer bag. Let me see. I really want to take the shoes off. I haven't had heels on in so long. Oh my God. This is the bag from Auto, also from Amazon Vine, so that's vibes. But I am, I'm basically done creating content at this point. I have some photos. Oh, and I'm tired. And Grandpa was also like throwing a tantrum right a few minutes ago, so that's why I'm looking at her. She just kept crying for nothing. I mean, she was hungry. But then even after I gave her food, she was still crying. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys the outfit before I take it off because I'm about to take it off. And these shoes are just to die for. I love them so much. Look at that, look at that goodness. Look at these beauties. Oh, my servo is off. What the hell, I'm sorry. <laughs> But look at this goodness isn't this just absolute beauty <laughs> it's from a brand called right toy but they're on Am amazon i would leave a link down below for you guys um for these shoes for the outer bag cute stuff you know this is giving like expensive shoes on a budget okay um if that makes sense <laughs> yeah but anyway uh i wanted to check in with you guys i'm done creating content i'm gonna go make some dinner i'm really craving some banco and okra because i saw someone on instagram post it then i'm like why would you do that so <laughs> i have some goat's meat i have like gone ahead to defrost that because you know if i want it i get it <laughs> it's a bad thing but yeah when i'm craving food i I'm sure to always make that food like yesterday as late as like um, 11 p.m. I was making ramen and I made it and it was so good and I had it and I felt so like happy you know 
so um yeah i'm gonna make okra i have to grab the okra i have to go out to grab the okra so i'm gonna run down to dollar tree to grab some okra that's the only place i find that no actually price shopper also has it but dollar tree is way closer to me than price shopper so dollar tree it is i'm gonna go to dollar tree grab some okra i also kind of want to grab a few things from dollar tree anyway so but i don't want to take so long because it's 5 30 and um, I want to finish cooking and everything because I have some things to unbox with you guys I have some new kitchen stuff that I want to unbox with you guys so I don't want to be I, I want it to be in and out you know so this is the makeup honestly I'm breaking out because it's almost that time of the month so my skin is really not like doing well right now but aside that I'm a pretty girl okay me I don't look at stuff like week out and you know <laughs> i don't think about stuff like that really um my skin and like i mean scrap that my makeup this is my makeup this is what it looks like okay i try to do like a nice brown look something fall inspired so yeah and then with my cute little fro so that is done um now i'm gonna go brush out <laughs> you know get that okra come back cook and then i'll see you guys later so we can unbox my cooking set i think you guys saw it when it came in yesterday when amazon delivered it yesterday but i'm so grateful for amazon vine and this opportunity that i have i think i'll sit down towards the end of the vlog to talk to you guys about like what's up what's had i mean like what i have been up to you know some of the new things that just some of the new things that have come into my life and i'm so grateful for them and i can't like i can't say how grateful i am i don't know like my <laughs> my thoughts are all over the place right now but let me settle cook that dinner i will show you when i'm done i won't show you the recipe because i don't want to stress myself with like angles and whatever but i'll show you guys something um and then i'll see you guys when i am done all right so yeah I'm oh my goodness let me show you guys this is <laughs> what i've been waiting for <laughs> so this is what i've been waiting for is the ninja foodie never stick set um this is a 13 piece so basically comes with one two three four five six seven eight plus the lid makes it 13 um but yeah let's go ahead and unbox this because <laughs> i i mean i want to like enjoy the moment of like unboxing and everything but i, I also really have to cook and i want to use like one of the pans from here you know because why not <laughs> so and that's in from about you guys here in the background okay she can't talk for ghana she can talk <laughs> she legit can't talk it's so big like it's a lot oh my god these pans are heavy okay <laughs> oven pants okay guys so this is the complete set so this is the bigger pan and as you guys can see this is of like very good quality like it is so heavy okay this is the small pot it is so heavy this is literally like the ones that our African moms used to use that looked so old but will still stay through pretty much everything that they do this looks like that it feels like that it feels so good it feels like proper quality i am so happy um this is the lids that come with them and then you have the ninja all over here 
hands are ashy forgive me but i just really want to show you guys this before i use them um this is honestly this stuff is so good like i don't even know what to say this is gonna last for a good time okay the um the estimated value is almost five hundred dollars for the entire set so again like i said towards the end of the vlog i will go deep into it because i really have to cook right now but yeah i will link this set for you guys down below if anyone is interested this and this is gonna last me a good amount of time it, i'm sure this can go all the way to like five years which is your money's worth you know so if you want to check them out please definitely um I'll, I'll leave an amazon link down below for you guys so you can check it out but i'm gonna get into cooking and i will definitely see you guys when i'm done so that we can just wind down and chill together but right now i have to cook so i'll see you when i see you all right hey guys let me pause this music so i don't get copyrighted but hey guys, so I'm on my way to work. But before I get to work, I have to go to the IMD for my Linux permit exam. <laughs> I'm hoping they make me do it online just so that um, I can go home and do it because if I have to do it there, I have no idea. I have no idea. I've only practiced about like two, three times. But because of COVID, I, um, what I learned is that they usually let you do it at home, online. So, fingers crossed, I'm able to do that. Also, if I'm able to do that, that way I can get to work because I have to get to work. I'm literally late already. So, um, yeah. I don't know why that looks like that, but whatever. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys at the end of the day, but I am here. I'm already at the RMV, so wish me luck, okay? Morning guys. I am, <laughs> I'm trying to move the GMC for the first time. I haven't moved it before. I don't even know how to do this. Oh, the shepherd. Ooh. I have never tried to move the GMC before. Good morning, guys. Oh, I look a little crappy, but I'm going to go pick up breakfast from Panera. I'm not driving, obviously. But I just came out earlier to see if I could like try to move it because it's new. And it's oh. okay. Okay. Oh nice. She's smooth. But that's good because I'm gonna do my driving exam soon. <laughs> so yeah but let's go and pick up breakfast from panera bread i took a day off work today so i could get my hair braided um but yeah it's a cold morning <laughs> hey guys super super random i came to dollar tree to check out a few things and i see that they have these really nice pumpkins I am trying to pick out some fall decor for my office desk at work and then also just possibly pick out um, something for home and I think these white ones are really cute I was hoping they would be orange but they're so cute the styles and the designs are also nice and they're also like very heavy that's like really a vibe and then they have these ones over here which are also like this but also like very very cute this one says grateful and you guys know I live by the term grateful I think it's, I don't know like oh, here's something else. oh 
my favorite body wash. This is my favorite body wash. Okay. I love this one. It has shea butter and brown sugar. Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, like, it's, it's kind of. I mean, the price is. It's not bad. That's what I can say. But I love it. I absolutely love it. And I need a hand soap for the bathroom because we ran out. I'm looking at this brand over here, which is really pretty. It's like nice and colorful and all the vibes. But this one here, Sugar Dream, Vanilla Almond and Sugar. And then they have another one that is coconut. And another one over here that is Jasmine. I think I might go for Jasmine. I think I just might go for that one. Yep. And also, let me see. This is a three in one bath and foam oil body wash. Ooh. And this has. This has a whole meditation thing going with it, like restoring. I have never actually tried this brand. It's a it's a bath foam oil and wash. That is really nice. Hey guys, so I'm back home um, from Panera. I'm on my camera now. I was on my phone earlier. The quality difference. Plus my phone is on iPhone 11, so... <laughs> but I'm back home. I am about to get my hair braided. I'm literally about to go through the blow drying process. And I figured I'll pick up my camera and, you know, braid my hair with you guys. Not the entire process, but you get the vibe. So that is what I'm going to be doing for the most part of today. Um, I'm taking care of my friend Papa. She's all set. So... Yeah, now it's just time for me to get into it. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just gonna put you guys somewhere ish and then we can get on with this hair, alright? And my hair is so grown now, also. See? Yeah. <laughs> and when I blow dry, you guys will see it's insane. Like, it's so grown. Period. <laughs> I'm gonna play some music on YouTube so I can get into this hair. I'm looking to do like really small braids. I don't know if I have the strength for it, but the determination is done. So that's all that we care about. The plan has been made for weeks. Okay, I've been planning this day for weeks. So I'm planned, I'm ready. I have some hair. I don't know if that will be enough. I actually have to take it out to be sure. Yeah, I think that'll be a good idea. And plus I don't have my microphone plugged in. So if you guys hear like the background echoey, that's the reason why, all right? But yeah, let's get into this. Oh, I did some yoga this morning, and my I feel like my body feels sore. But the whole idea of doing that yoga was to make me feel relaxed. But instead, I feel sore still. I'm hoping that that should go away. But whatever. Anyway. <laughs> I have this mix on YouTube that I play, so that's what I'm doing. I haven't been able to do so much I'm not gonna lie I started off <clears throat> honestly I'm so tired I started off thinking that I was gonna do um, like knotless braids 
because I was like, oh, let me do knotless braids a lot more easier on my hair because also my hair is very fragile, so I didn't want to like do too much. But then I wasn't feeling the knotless braid and it was taking so much time in the back. And obviously, I'm not like a pro pro. <laughs> So I had to like, you know, and then I decided to just do regular braids, which started going well, but I'm still here. Like I'm currently on this one right here, and then I'd have one, two, three to go. And from her slip, she just woke up. She's sitting on the floor right there, over there. Yeah. So if I let her come outside, she's gonna mess up my whole hair, everything. But she's okay she's eating another thing is i'm watching the series on hbo i've been watching it for a while sweet life la with tylen it's tylen yeah tylen and her friends oh i'm so happy this i love this series okay i love their friend group i love the drama and everything and how fast they like solve issues is just love it so that's what has been keeping me company and i've been laughing a lot so if you if you haven't checked out like Sweet Life on HBO Max, check them out. It's such a nice, like, it's a real life thing. Like, how do they call that thing? It's a reality TV show. So it's like their actual real life. So friends in real life showing you, you know, how they are trying to level up as like black friends and also how they are like being friends and solving their issues and growing up. It's beautiful. I love them. So that's the vibe but i just wanted to give you guys an update this is how far we've come i'm gonna be curling the ends so i leave about like that much but yeah it's a whole lot of like messy hair going on but yeah it's a vibe so i'll see you guys later okay hey guys hey guys so it is much much later it's actually 11 i feel like i always come to you guys at 11 p.m but i showered you know like did my nighttime routine did some self care Papa is still not sleeping but she's all set to be sleeping she has been all set since 9 30 p.m and she's still not sleeping i'm trying to i mean she's good at sleeping by herself so this is something she always does anyway but i just wanted to you know end the vlog and then also just checking with you guys because in the beginning of the vlog i did mention that i was gonna you know catch you guys up with like what's up and where i've been you know why i've been away from youtube and all of that shebang <laughs> basically the tall and short is i felt disconnected from youtube for a while i'm not gonna lie just the whole having the camera in my face all the time it wasn't even about having the camera in my face because I was still doing my Instagram videos. It was just the whole idea. I felt like I was putting pressure on myself when it came to like my vlogs and you know just how I wanted to present my vlogs and I didn't like that because I I just didn't like the fact that it was putting pressure on me and I wasn't feeling myself, you know. I didn't feel like I was giving you guys me and that is not who i am like i am me in all entirety in everything that i do so whenever i feel like i'm not giving me it makes me feel very uncomfortable it makes me feel disconnected you know what i'm saying so i loved doing what i was doing but for some time for like a good amount of time i just felt very disconnected and i felt like you know what i'm, I'm gonna put this away for a while not put pressure on myself and do the part of content creation that I actually did love which was doing makeup because when I started actually focusing on my vlogs I wasn't putting much energy in my makeup again so I just went back picked up my makeup again and I think it was a good thing because I took time away from doing YouTube content completely. The only thing that I was uploading on my YouTube was sh YouTube Shorts, which was basically my Instagram videos, repurposing them for my YouTube, just to keep the page active because ob obviously I'm a new YouTuber. You don't want to go away for so long because that affects the like analytics and all of that, you know. So 
it was like a lot of thinking for me i just had to take time and ask myself if i kept asking myself sometimes i felt like this is this wasn't something that i was supposed to be doing but then also i'm like you've been doing this for almost eight years like i've had my youtube channel for over seven years at this point you know so this is something i have been thinking of doing for such a long time i just haven't putting so much work i haven't put in so much energy i keep going off and on you know so i i took time away to like actually ask myself these questions do you really want to do this is this something that feels forced you know and coming back it just feels the perfect time <laughs> i couldn't have come back at the right time it feels perfect it feels natural it doesn't feel forced it feels like um i'm in a place where i feel like yeah yeah you know i'm in a place where i feel like i'm gonna give you guys me okay i was really judging myself i'm not even gonna lie sometimes i'll show up on camera and in my mind i'm like oh i'm showing you guys like me because this is really who i am when i'm home you know and then also another part of me will be judging me and thinking oh you're not supposed to be looking like that on camera because there are all these other youtube girls who are nice and cute and you know and i'm not saying that i'm not pretty don't get it wrong <laughs> i have like self-confidence but also sometimes self-sabotage sets in and then you're asking yourself all these questions so i had to take time back and reevaluate myself you know just basically re you know restructure my thinking yeah so like i'm saying it feels like perfect timing and as i mentioned when i went away a lot of these things like a lot of opportunities just kept coming <laughs> and i'm like why is it that just when i'm not doing content all these opportunities are coming i'm sure yesterday i mentioned that so i had the like i have the opportunity to work with amazon as an as like a amazon reviewer so basically you just i review products on amazon let me not just say you just review i review products on amazon um in return for like buying i don't even know how to put it in return for like getting things off of amazon you know so that is a very big opportunity in itself i can't even begin to say how grateful i am for that opportunity and it's just it has literally turned my life around i'm not even going to lie i'm going to be honest about it sometimes honestly like i'm my i'm sitting at the edge of my seat literally <laughs> i mean not literally figuratively <laughs> i'm not sitting at the edge of my seat but that's how i feel um sharing this with you know you guys because also coming from where i come from you know my background and everything it just really is a little uncomfortable sharing um your successes you know because sometimes you feel like people are gonna come for you like it's just really weird so it's a lot that i'm like trying to structure my thinking about and if you relate or if you feel what i'm saying just comment below and let me know that i'm not going crazy okay but yeah like i have that opportunity to work with amazon and i'm so grateful and if you're on my instagram you've seen that i'm also like constantly posting about these guys from hide i'm also working with them um i've been working with them for a few months now our contract is on hold for now but i've been working with hide for a while i'm super grateful been working with all these like little little companies sending me stuff skincare brands wanting me to try their stuff like it's just really amazing okay and i'm, I'm just so grateful for like my life right now i'm just really grateful i can't begin to say how grateful i am <laughs> like it's not even and i've come to realize that it's not even like the big things you know it's not even the <laughs> it's all the little little things that you pray for that um like you get and then you know that the universe is listening to you good spirits are listening to you and you're just really grateful so i'm happy that i actually did take that time off because 
I like came to understand certain things about me and just came to understand what I'm worth you know like I know what I what I bring to the table I know what I'm worth as a person as a woman as a wife as like a worker as an employee as a content creator like <laughs> so I am confident in myself and I'm confident in what I know that I want to bring in like my content and I know that with time all of that is gonna show so I'm not gonna be hard on myself I'm just gonna take it one day at a time give you guys me as I said in all entirety so if you relate with me obviously you will stay and if you don't you will find the back door which I respectfully <laughs> I mean which I respect okay I respect boundaries I respect people's opinions and I respect that every human being is entitled to their opinion and what they choose to subscribe to and what they choose to not subscribe to so respectfully I know that people who relate to me will stick with me and people who don't will find their way so yeah that's basically it I just felt disconnected took some time off came back I mean coming back now and I am feeling perfect coming back now I'm feeling like I know what I want to do with my platform so yeah i i'm happy i'm happy to be back and i hope you guys are happy to have me back i mean i don't ignore that but whatever so um <laughs> the hair is done i will honestly because i'm gonna go to bed i don't want to unravel this whole thing but i promise i'll show you guys like a full video of the hair tomorrow but i'm gonna end the vlog here which means that the next clip will obviously be the clip of me in the hair you know i mean showing you guys the hair but i'm gonna end the vlog here it's been a few days in my life you guys have obviously seen basically how like my life is all over the place right now but i'm super grateful um for everything that i have and um i can't even like I can't even I don't even know the right words to use but I'm grateful is all I can say and I'm happy to be back I hope that you like this vlog I hope that um, you like the few days of my life I mean I hope that you enjoyed it um, and I'll see you guys in next week's vlog so basically what I'm gonna do is um, I'm trying to bring back the weekly vlogs let me drink some water because ooh. <laughs> but I'm trying to bring back the weekly vlogs so um, that would be fun I'm excited for that and for the rest of the evening I'm basically gonna be editing this vlog because I have to get it out no pressure but I still have to get it out by tomorrow so I'm gonna be working on that and then also possibly doing some Amazon reviews because I have um, some things to review I have a lot to review Ooh. But yeah, so I'll see you guys in next week's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys um, like, subscribe, share, all of that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys.